only on Fox tonight. A new program in the Valley is giving people with Parkinson's disease an opportunity to literally fight the disease. It's fitting tribute to the man known as the greatest of all time. And patients at the Muhammad Ali Parkinson Center are learning boxing techniques to fight the effects of their disease. Fox 10's Nicole Garcia shows us how. Ready for rumbling. They have tremors. Right. They move slower. And go. They have Parkinson's right. disease. And they pack Good. a mean punch. Nice. These men and women are champion yeah, fighters in their three, own four. right, with One, the will two, three, to win right. with a knockout. Yeah. I can visualize you know, the disease in front of me, and every time I strike a blow, and the harder I can hit, the, yeah. the, the, maybe the, the, the more I'm pushing Parkinson's back. Um, it may, may take okay. everything in the end. Yes. Step. I'm not going down without a fight. Yes. Step. Scott Weisorek was step. diagnosed with Parkinson's in his 30s. The knockout Parkinson's boxing program gives him a sense of empowerment over the disease that has robbed him of his movement and coordination. Yeah. Oh. Out of it from the workout um, and, and the health aspect of it, but I think from the psychological aspect, I, I get significantly more out of it. Like I had the poles on one side. The instructor, a professional who has trained competitive athletes in martial arts and boxing. Left, left, right. There's a lot of cadenza, there's a tempo involved. So there are many parameters and there are many factors that they have to consider to execute this particular drill. Yes, especially for Parkinson's, it's very important to actually switch back from the left to the right. To actually challenge yeah. those neural pathways. So, Please turn. He's put together an intense, fast-paced yeah, program. Left. Lateral yes. shuffles. Metronome. So it's two, three, four, one, two, three, a demanding four, routine four, even for those four, without four, the disease. Four, yeah, four, definitely doable. A lot of the exercises um, that we do um, are, are, are difficult to do in, in, in sequence, so uh, moving is, 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 is harder than Ready? it used to be. One, two, three, four. It has been shown that, that, that doing that type of um, um, exercise actually does improve improve people's day-to-day -day function um, and reduces disability down the road. One, two, three, four. Although there is Nancy, no scientific yeah. research that shows the yes, benefits Bert, of boxing on. for come Parkinson's on. patients, yes. there is Bedroom. one role model, That's all right. the legendary champion Bert, Muhammad Ali. He did. He started with Parkinson's disease at a young age and, and obviously lived many, many years with it. So um, so one has to wonder if in some ways his, his commitment to boxing actually helped him do better with Parkinson's disease. We're very, very proud proud to have this boxing program at our center as a, as a tribute to Muhammad nice. Ali. Nice. Exercise may slow the progression down, but there's nothing that's going to stop it. But at least I can, I can go in and give it all I have to, to prevent four. getting worse. One, two, three, four. All right. There is no cure Very for nice. Parkinson's disease. You can keep on moving. But people in this group have the will to keep yes. living and the ambition to float like a butterfly yes. and sting like a bee. Good. It's kind of almost symbolic. It's, it's like fighting the disease. So every punch yep. I can throw and every, yep. every step I take and all the effort I put into it, um, yep. it's kind of like yep. Parkinson's can have everything yep. eventually, yep. but not now. I'm not yep. going to give it without a fight. Good. And take a break. Good. Nicole Garcia, Fox 10 News. What a great program there. And that boxing class is open to all Parkinson's patients. You don't have to be a patient at the Muhammad Ali Parkinson Center to sign up.